T-13, take one. Okay. And while you're looking into the camera, you can uh, answer my question as to whether you think that would make a good paternity dress or not. No, I don't really think so. You don't? Really? No. Call her, Marty. Zippy. Good room you. I spent a little of your money today. You spent some of my money today? Yes. I bought a few things. How do you like this? I don't like it, but it looks like you spent more than just a little of my money. Really? What's the matter with your walk? Well, you have to learn how to walk all over again in this dress. Look really? at the slit in the back. I you know. Why don't you get one that's See? finished? It seems to be damaged. Where? In the back. It's all cut open. Oh, my dear. You've got a lot to learn. Well, I don't wear those things, so I guess you that's... Oh, you look rather silly in them, too. Well, there have been sure. moments. This kind of marvelous. Would you like to see some of the others? Yes, you have more? Yes, several. Yeah. I told you I spent some of your money today. That's an answer. How do you like the walk? Not much. No? No. Come down there. Come down. Come down. In the final position there. I look at those people there out there. Who the hell they think they are? Strange to say. That touch your nose a bit. You want to profile it? Yeah. Talk to them, Marty. Come here. Listen, Teddy, we don't, don't do right us all now. a favor. You tell us. Now, don't, don't turn the body to him. Excuse me. Uh, yes, sir. Now, talk to him in profile. Pardon me, Marty. Yeah, would you explain that name, Tippy? What is it? What is the? Where does it originate from? It's a Swedish nickname. For what? For Tupsa. For what? Tupsa. Would you say that again, please? Tupsa. Thank you very much. You're uh, welcome. That's an uh, anatomical term. <laughs> Meaning? Tupsa. Little girl. Oh, really? Yes. In Swedish. All right, Marty, go on, take over. Mm. Listen, Ted, I'm not going to put you on. <laughs> but would you, how do you feel about this whole experience? Well, well, that's a terrible question to ask. You can be honest. Whatever you feel about Hitch is perfectly all right because we all know what he is. You know, mean, all that stuff. Yeah, you mean can say whatever you want. Well, possibly I see a little different side of him. You do? Yeah. Please explain it. Yes. Nobody else has so far. No? No. Well? Let's see that coat around the back. Has he treated you badly? Terrible. That's what I'm Go trying to say. Go a couple of steps. Now turn the profile, look at him. But no, let's see the back, only the head, not the body. But that's it, now turn the head well round. No, no, to him. I mean, keep turning until the head drops off, you know. What? <laughs> that's it. It rolls away on the floor. Yeah. I'll give it a little sharp, and Marty can pick it up, you know. That's right. And it can be buried into the garden. Oh, Marty, keep talking to him. And she looked over her shoulder at him. You know, I'm more than just an average head figure. How are you doing on shrinking? Closer up to the thing here. I've been shrunk. <laughs> but really, hasn't it been a lovely experience, Tim? It's been a beautiful experience. Yeah. I've cut it enough of experience. Save it. T-18, take three. Action. My husband's gone now. I don't think he'll be back. Good, now we can play. I wonder if I can trust you alone. No, you can't. You know that. Tell me, Mr. Balsam, what exactly do you have in mind? Why do you call me Mr. Balsam? I mean, if your husband's <laughs> gone away, you call me Mr. Balsam. I don't think we can go much further. What do I have in mind? Yes. Remember the subject we were talking about before? Which subject? Paroxysms. Oh, I missed that. I, mi I missed that whole No, it's paroxysms and necrophilia. Oh, well, I remember the necrophilia, but I don't remember You remember the necrophilia? Yes. Very That's nice. marvelous. Isn't that wonderful? Yeah. yeah. Well, what do you say? You want a necrophilia? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. I think this has ruined me forever. What's that? We're going to change the stuff. I think so, too. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Would you like to see my new suit? Did you look at it? Yes, I saw it from my father. It's lovely. It really is. Very simple bow. Is that's the only fastening on it. Nothing in the back? No. Something new. This one. Mm -hmm. No back to him again. Go ahead and tell him. Go ahead. 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 Go ahead.
yours? Well, they're mine to wear. They're yours to wear. Well, I must say they're really... Is that voice lower? Yes. Gawky, remember Gawky? Yes, death? that's true. Your favorite book? Yes. Do you like his dress? Very much. I see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And all those tops that you saw before? Yes. They all go with it. The same tops, yes, the same outfits that you wore with the... Yes, you change all of them. With the white ones, too? That's right. And That's the black right. coat. Yeah. It goes over this. Then all you need is just the black and the white dress, and you've That's got right. about six different outfits. That's right. Mm-hmm. How about the hair? It's new, too. You can change it, too? Yes. Yeah. Yes, I see the lace. It's lovely. How do you feel about the mouth? How do I feel about the mouth? Yeah. Let me see. the mouth more closely. Let me see. Try it on. Try it on. I really feel about you. <laughs> do you? Yes. It's lovely. I love your eyes, too. I cut it. Okay. David. I told you yesterday when you went to the hairdresser, I want you to dye your hair back to brown. I don't want to have brown hair. I don't care hair. what you want. It's my hair, in a sense. I mean, I'm paying for it, aren't I? I beg your pardon. It's me. It's you, but I'm I... paying for all that business up there. I think I would like to have a color that I like, not what you like. Is that well, unfair? It's something, you know, a lot of things have occurred to me lately. What's that? You know, I don't believe I've ever met anyone quite as calculating as you are. What's so calculating? I just like to watch where my money's going. Honey, you're all. trying to just completely run my life. I would just like to know what is happening with my money. If you told me yesterday that you're going to dye your hair back to dark, then I assume that you're going to do so. If you're going to get it you even know, lighter it, than it was before, what's the point? It occurs to me that this is not the problem. Well, what is the problem? Well, there's a few things like, uh, I don't mind you sort of shopping for a wife. Yeah. I don't right, mind either. You know, but when it gets to the point where it's four girls you're seeing, then three. What are you talking and about? And then two. Like you're actually going to a shop and buying. Those girls commission me. I'm commissioned by those girls. They have, there's nothing to do with what you. What do you mean commissioned? They pay me to do their shopping for them because they don't know what the hell to buy for themselves. That's got nothing oh, to do with the color of your I hair, mean. though. Hmm? That's not what I mean. Well, what do you mean? You are shopping for a wife. Yeah. Come do your hair again. <clears throat> well, keep it up. Keep it up. Talk. Are you assuming? Are, are you saying that I'm shopping for four wives? No, you are not. You're shopping for a wife for yourself. You're pretending you don't for... know what I'm talking about. Oh, for heaven's sake! I hate petty arguments. Look, this is not me. petty. This the is color not of your petty, hair but... is very important to me. I told you I like brunettes, and I told you to get your hair back from light to dark. And you told me you would yeah. you were going to do this. Now, am I hearing things? Am I making it up or what? You know something? I don't think I want to see you anymore. Well, then, kindly pay me for the money I laid out for your hair. You may laugh, but it's not funny. I mean, there's you and those other three girls. Ooh. Cut it. <laughs> David. <laughs> 